How's the hanging fellas? I'm Orush and this is another episode of Portal Knights and in today's episode uh, we are back in North Point. Back in Nightmare in North Point we are still. Alright so here's the shit we have to do. Fallen Soldiers defeated this. There's no place I know so far that has Fallen Soldiers in it so we're gonna have to go somewhere else. And there's these two places. One of them has a key which is an important thing. And we gotta return Captain Pickles to this bitch in the fucking pirate town. But Captain Pickles, as far as I'm aware, is in a completely unrelated location. Uh, doing some other bullshit. So that's what he's up to. And I, between episodes, managed to get a full set of Defender Breasts of Defender armor. You know what, this armor would actually look pretty cool on GZB, but I am using this stupid Valkyrie armor, which is, I think, an armor set meant for women, but GZ doesn't care. And I do have a new axe, which is uh, quite better than the axe I had before. It works the exact fucking same. I thought it would be the axe that like swings around much faster, but this is not. The I wonder how the other axe would work. If we ever get uh, enough materials to make the other axe, I'll probably make it since it's way better than this one. And if they both work the same, then I might as well have the fucking one that has like twice as much damage. Oh, fuck off. Trying to use a portal, you asshole. Got a drink here called B Powered Energy Drink Hot Fire. I hope hot fire doesn't doesn't mean that it's the flavor of it. I really do. <coughs> I choked on a fucking on a bubble, Jesus. <coughs> um. Oh, gross! It is the flavor. What the fuck? Spicy energy drinks? Oh, this is disgusting. I mean, it's not like disgusting, but like... Why the fuck would I eat a... Drink a spicy energy drink? Come on, I thought hot fucking fire was just referring to like... The amount of energy I'll have. After this shit. Not how it fucking tastes. You gotta be kidding me. Can I not get a fucking good energy drink? I'm just keep finding shitty ones. I should just buy all, all the ones I had already, but like are good. Like I did a while back when I had a monster. Anyway, it seems like we are in a location. Oh, that's that's the place. We found it. Fallen soldiers. Are there foreign soldiers? These are fallen pirates. There's Captain Whatever here, and he well has a quest for us. But we'll probably do this episode. I know what you want. You want me totem. Well, I stole it fair and square. Off with you, yellow dog. Unless I can interest you in some fair trade. Me buried treasures. All I think about. Alas, I've forgotten where I buried it. And my sap-headed donkey brain crew got themselves killed in that mine. If you find the map, we'll talk about that totem you're after. Alright. Uh, follow the quest, damn it. Gnarly parley. We got him. First of all, make our way to the mine. Alright, this is this is good enough. Let's blow it up one more time. She took enough damage. I'll fuck off with you guys. I'm sick of your bullshit. Damn it, he's following me around. Alright, you I can oh, fuck. They both followed me. So fucking tight in here, I can't see anything. I hope I won't hit that explosive barrel. And blow myself up. I didn't, thank God. I think Captain Pickles isn't here, actually. Let's focus on this guy, because this guy is so annoying. At least this fallen fire is easier to deal with. Can kind of easily avoid his attack. While the other pirate kind of had a thing with the gun where he shoots really fast and he's annoying as fuck. To be honest with you, I don't really remember where Captain Pickles is. I remember that when I played on my other playthrough, I didn't know where the fuck Fennimore is. And I actually found Captain Pickles before I found Fennimore. Remember Fennimore? He's the guy who was like stuck in a dungeon. I can't believe in this game where everybody's so generic I actually remember some characters' names. 
Well, Freddy Moore was important to a quest, so maybe that's why I remembered him. Nice little, uh... Little fucking hut. Well, I am dealing a lot more damage, that's nice. These fires would be so fucking annoying if it wasn't for my nice damage I got going on. There we go. I feel like GZB is already better than the other character I have. Maybe. Yeah, so we gotta get through this dungeon, get the treasure map, and then after the treasure map, we gotta find the treasure. But don't you think that you can actually read the treasure map and have an idea of where the treasure is buried? No, 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 that's, that's how it works. I, uh, straight up, when I did this quest, my first time around, I didn't realize where the mine is, because I didn't realize you have to shoot a wall with a cannon. So I went outside of that cave we were in at the beginning, and I started looking around, and I found the treasure marked by a red X before I found the treasure map. So yeah, two quests that I did out of order on my other character. On this character, I actually don't even know how to do it in order, because I so far only did it out of order, so... I'm a little confused in that one. Also, I probably won't be able to record uh, any episodes tomorrow, because I gotta get up earlier than usual. And yes, I'm still on a timer. I got uh, an hour. It's fine, though, the episodes aren't that long. That's why I actually like this series, because the episodes aren't very long. It's not like Skyrim where I'm going for half an hour and then hope to get as much out of it as possible. You know what's the worst thing? Like, since I decided that Portal Knights is gonna be my additional Let's Play, I've been recording for the past two weeks nothing but Portal Knights. And some gameplays and such, but that doesn't matter. And, oh, there you go, I think I found it. I think? Is Captain Pickles in here? It's the treasure map. Why well, he had just like random crystals growing right in front of the fucking table. I thought that was like a secret stash that was kind of lit up when I walked in here. Yeah, yeah what was I saying? Um... Yeah, Skyrim is a longer let's play than this, and... Oh yeah, Danganronpa. I was recording Danganronpa, and we stopped. I stopped recording at a point where I was collecting clues about Sayaka's death. My girlfriend, right? Because she got killed in a bathroom. Spoiler alert. And I was supposed to collect clues as to what the fuck happened, and then I guess next part of the game is me proving that I'm not the killer because everyone suspects me because she was killed in my bathroom. Well, that'll probably go really fucking well since I haven't played the game in a long fucking while and I doubt I'll be done with Portal Knights by the end of... Well, I hope I'll be done with this game by the end of this month, at the very least. Because next month is Saints Row. I wanted to play that. And I hope before I play Saints Row I'll have like one week full of Danganronpa and one full of Skyrim so I can have some more episodes. And if I don't manage to do that... I guess I'll have to intertwine my fucking let's plays with Saints or somehow. Me map! Oh, I never thought I'd see it again. So, you're not such a greenhorn after all. Come find me when you're ready for a real score. It's a pirate flag! Why couldn't I get the pride flag? Now that I have the map, it's time to reclaim the lost treasure of Brinbread. Brinbread? I don't know. I get what's in me chest, and in return you get the totem, savvy? I don't know, pirate talk, I don't know what fucking savvy means. We gotta search for the treasure. Oh, X marks the spot. For my booty. I hope it's not too far away. Since I picked normal side... Side... Sized... Islands... Well, it shouldn't be... Oh, there it is. It's like... On the other ha fucking character, the island here was fucking huge. And I straight up looked for like, I don't know, at least an hour just fucking walking around. And for some reason the island spawned in such a way that I, there was like giant fucking chasms I had to get across. 
What's that, sweet water? You hope for bitches to at the end of this quest? Me too. Yeah. There's the, the red X. Like that, uh... Fucking... Is, is it a superhero? Oh yeah, Red X was the, the Teen Titans thing. Right? Where it's like Robin's alter ego. So he could get in the in the hive. If I recall what the fuck happened in Teen Titans, which I haven't seen in probably over ten years. You don't suppose his uh, his treasure was the Red X itself. Yeah, I, I doubt it. Probably was this this treasure room. The chest in here, and I got a golden hook. How the fuck do I get out of here? Guess it's digging up. Very nice. We might as well check out these little houses, see if there's anything worth while in each one of them. Doesn't seem to be. It doesn't even seem like anybody lives in these. They look like storage spaces more than houses. Why, why are they so far apart? Maybe people just sleep on the floor around here. Oh, this one looks a little more significant. They had a fire guarding it and everything. Some shocking mess. Oh, these windows open and close. You know what, fuck it, I'm, I'm checking these windows. I was trying to get the, the other windows. My house is still missing a window. Because I couldn't find the- Whoa, what the fuck are these guys? Because I, I couldn't find the proper window that the rest of the house has. Okay, I don't like them fucking teleporting. Who shot me with acid? I think they did. Hey, not bad. It really is Dark Souls and keep rolling around. It's Dark Souls for kids. Supposedly Elden Ring is a little easier than most Dark Souls games, but I don't know about that. It sounds like some something someone would say, like, No, don't worry, dude, it's not as hard as Dark Souls. You'll totally love it. Like, you, you think you're sure about that? You think I'll love it? I think I'll fall in love with this game and actually beat it? Only Dark Souls game I played for, like, a good while was Dark Souls 3. And the reason I never finished it, not because it was hard, because my friend came over and accidentally deleted my save file, and I was like, eh, fuck it. It's the hook me dear mother brought me, bought me when I was a lad. Oh, my heart full of joy. All right, cool. We got a cursed totem. That's a big gem, but whatever. And we can trade with the guy. He has some really good stuff. Has a gun? Oh, it's for a ranger. Fuck you. Replica of the dragon totem piece. Oh, I can be a pirate. I don't want to be a pirate, though. Alright, bye. One man's trash. Could Pickle be in here? There's like a whole area underneath his ship, which I don't even know what the fuck it houses. Apart from these assholes. Man, I'm getting mad. If only, if only I had some kind of a spell, I could look like, easy against them. Man, I should have invested in magic, this shit sucks. Probably due to me not having good magic efficiency. The fucking rest of magic get magic it for nerds by the way and I ain't no fucking nerd alright 
I solve my issues fair and square with a blade in people's faces. Just like I did right now. Alright, so we gotta keep the treasure probably on us. So I don't fucking get rid of it by accident. But who knows which area will have the totem? Well, actually, I think it will be the... It'll probably be this one. Which we don't have access to yet. And I probably should go up here and explore a little bit. Don't you think? Like, Captain Pickles could be here. I don't know. Anything could be lurking within these fucking places. What is with North Point and having some weird shit? Alright, so this is probably it for this location. Mysterious portal. Ooh. Uh, what the fuck's that? I don't know. Mysterious portal spawned in on that location? That location is pretty small, we could probably find it. And I don't think it has any dungeons. We got three hours to find it, guys, quick. No time to lose. Oh, there it is. Looks fucking scary. Oh, it spawned in with like a... Bunch of weird shit around it. Ancient mummy? Oh, mummy. Green carpet block. Oh, I'm getting green blocked already. Look. I was terrorized by a fucking mock earlier this night. He's using like. He's breathing like black at me. I don't know what that is. Oh, I'm getting cursed. Which I think curses do if you deal damage, you receive damage yourself. Do I need green portal blocks? No, yellow ones. This portal looks ominous and scary. Red and stuff. I meant to go here and go to the other portal we had, which is the one a little further away. You can see it over there behind that house a little bit. So what was this? Oh, turn off. Alright, we'll go into this hellish portal in the next episode, I think. See you fellas in the next episode. Bye.